Here we are on day five of the 45 day loft conversion challenge and today we've installed the staircase so the the floor previously was just joisted and this was the ceiling from the area below so the guys have basically cut out this hole in the floor today and removed the ceiling from below and the staircase was made to measure by staircase manufacturer and was brought to site and has been assembled on site today. The staircase has been assembled on site in, in different pieces. We'll just walk down, we can see where it was cut out. Let's just have a walk down this staircase. So it's been assembled in pieces. And you can see the balustrading has been put on, and under here it's come in different pieces which have been fitted. Today. So this is the where they've constructed the hole in the ceiling. It's a nice, neat job, nice and square. And the actual staircase itself has been fitted, it's been screwed to. The original external wall. And the turn is here. And this was previously landing balustrade, it's been cut out. And they've joined two balustrades here. And this piece here has been put in until all of the glue. And the adhesive goes off overnight. That'll be removed tomorrow. The balustrading's been put in, so if we go downstairs. We can see how it how it flows. This is the original staircase. It's walking up, where the floor protection was put in place before the work started. This is the landing, and then we come up to the new. Balustrade and stairs. So we've got, in this case, we've got three straight steps, then the winders. We come round up the winders, up to the top, and then into the loft space. Now, this will be landing, the minimum landing I think is 850. So we're going to have that, which will come here, and then we're up into the main room itself. So just to look back at those stairs from above, this is the hole that's been cut into the ceiling below, and these stairs have been fixed in. And then brought around, there's just the balustrading's all in place, and then this section here will be the landing, and then where the floor joist is will be the door into the room itself. The other work that's been done today is the construction of the bathroom. So we've got the back room or the back section of the bedroom. There's the window, this will be the room, and then in the corner over that section will be the bathroom. So the door has been fixed into the middle of the bathroom. So as we come round, we can see the opening is where the door is going to be fixed. And this, the dimensions of this room, we've got 1.5 meters. So this is 1.5 meters across the floor. So as you go through the door here on the left, we're going to have uh, this, this section on the left, it's gonna be a wall to wall shower on the left. Then we'll have a vanity unit in the middle, toilet to the right, window here. And then opposite the toilet, we will have wall hung radiator. So, and the door to this room will open Outwards, we'll have the light switch here as you walk towards the wall, and then the rest of the room is as previously seen. So it's starting to take shape. We've now got on day five, we've got the stairs are now in place, so they're done. 
we've got the stud work for the bathroom is in place that's all done the wiring is starting so we're going to have to fix lights into all of these ceiling joists we're going to have to put switches onto the wall the plumbing's going to start tomorrow we're going to bring some pipe work up to feed the bathroom to feed the radiators that are going to be in this room and the wiring for the electrics is all being done for the power and the lighting so starting to take shape 